very different from each other thanks to the multipliers and I get different fresh results every time I publish the movie and ten times one two three four five six seven eight nine ten exactly as my cycle should do run it ten times run this function ten times this is a proper full and complete cycle also if you remember I told you before that when you execute a cycle flash on the basis of the hierarchy of the position of that piece of code on the action script executes first the code that appears at the header of the document and then it proceeds down the list so as long as it's executing this code it does not execute other cycles or pieces of code but once this piece of code has been executed it can go on and for example trace word stop now the thing is that it would run this cycle create the 10 circles and run this successive command trace stop with such speed that you probably couldn't see the difference but as you can see it has created the circles and then let's accept the fact that flash does it in this way it creates these circles and then writes the word stop we tested this before when we Traced the output of our first function and it traced out from 0 to 9 and then wrote the word stop right at the end of this procedure. Okay, now the circles that we are creating have the same color outline. What if I wanted to randomize the color of the outline too? How do I do that? So let's say I go here and instead of writing this hexadecimal color value, which is a bright pink color, let's say if I use my math command again to randomize the color let's say math random this is a very useful command math random and I close my bracket so this is my command complete command and I multiply that random value random number 